right you are. Remember to keep an eye out for anyone suspicious. If you think you've seen this person, you must report it to the authorities at once. It is your duty. Ah, it's you. I wanted the chance to thank you again for what you have done for my daughter. She can live a full and healthy life now, one a father can be proud of. I thank you once more. I hope the heavens look kindly on you and give you a fate to be proud of. Sipas ayer ki unyer, Juan Lurk shinro ni sipa. Owo sayer u yukap tan tharundano, wowo tarwayer shafir owo. Owo sayer u yukap tan tharundano, wowo tarwayer shafir owo. Owo sayer u yukap tan tharundano, wowo tarwayer shafir owo. Wowo sun ponono, ya papap nasia yu yo saye uoth. Sa ir yakuak, kokonato si ir ipano niliku. Woto we u kawana ir u soana da hoki. Niato u nonapati irovir. Ikir nik tine piru, wo ifirek uk son puno. Niato u nanapati irovir, kuni uk nawata ir. Wo anania ifuwir uk sonoruk noka uk snapir. Kuni puk no sankut na no wana nyapir, isana yuyo. Tasi ir si ir tintu. Funye wo 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 si ye wo ta fu fu. Ikir nik tine piru wo iferek uok son puno. Wo apa we er sun urk funye uok. Uok si er sa fit kup kup wo sarkir. No choir to ak ifruir, no capifu tatuir choir for nurt. He didn't deserve to die. Koriak anatir, ud choir washun. Ok yo will roof beer me sayer fianfushpa, sayer renkipa, sayer thin opi wuwuth, u sayer wanzan. Akwiwo ofir, san kasoir wo wo si utana. Ukirwir, no fantayana ukona ni pina towa. Niato na napadi irovir, kuni ugnawa te ir. 
Ku apa wayer sun urk ponir uk. Uk siir safit kuk kuk wo sarkir. Ku ayer ki yer iyo ni wo sahir branti. Onu you will rap here, Sakwanu ya wunir. Kwa ayir, ki yir iyo nibu sahir branti. Ir kana, wo nikasuri ir kwana no kasa ir iroro. Onu you will napa ir, wo kwa ir shap shir fan, onu you sa ir ikupan. Oh no, you saw ear. I can't keep ear. Tawe ear, kuana ear, so ni ear ipoki. Wo kauso ear no ka wo o taro ear shaks ear o fino pifu. Ear kana, wo nika suri ear kuana no ka sa ear iroro. Be careful in the Lotus Assassin Fortress. They may not know you are an enemy, but they can still be dangerous. That is not really necessary right now, although I do enjoy the attention. We have come so far together. Thank you for that. Very well. Don't go too far. We need to stay together. They say you're in good with the guild. You're allowed into the back rooms where Sweet Poison Lin runs her shop, aren't you? Uh, I have a favor to ask of you when you have a moment. My name's Gambler Daoshen, by the way. I run the straightest dice in the Imperial City. I wouldn't want to feed my children with tarnished silver, would I? <laughs> good odds and fair play. That's how I keep them coming back. A simple enough game called high-low. You predict how you'll roll against my toss and double your coin if you're right. You'll catch on easily enough, I'm sure. I know you're allowed to go freely into the back room past Kui's office. Would you carry a message to someone in there for me? There's a merchant in the back named Sweet Poison Lin. She has connections with the guild, the real authorities in this place. I want to expand my operation, but without the guild's approval and protection, I can only take very small bets. If I made any larger transactions, they'd be quite upset. I spoke to some of the lesser guild members, and there's a set fee that must be paid to Sweet Poison Lin. It took me some time to save up the silver, but I have the fee. I just can't get back there to talk to Lin and pay her directly. If you could go in there and pay her on my behalf, I'd happily repay you. I would never do that. I'd be shut down or worse in a heartbeat. And there's too many people who'd happily report the infraction to Sweet Poison Lin. The guild rewards those who can prove that people in my position aren't playing by their rules. 
My thanks. I'm sure Sweet Poison Lin knows about my interest. I've been angling this deal for a while. You should run back there now. The sooner you go, the sooner we can up the ante. What do you need from me? Dao Shen? <laughs> he has angled for a long time for our permission to run a larger game. He's honest to a fault, but he still pulls in a fair bit of cash. I was wondering if he'd be resourceful enough. One of my associates has already told him of the cost involved. Are you here to deliver his payment? His payment? Good. Give it to me, and I'll send someone to go discuss the new terms of his operation. Now, back to our business, yes? I'll be here when you need more of my goods. Don't you just love the Imperial Arena? No other place like it in all of the Jade Empire. Hold on, you're a raging dragon, aren't you? I've heard all about you. It's a pleasure. I'm Lady Rento. Oh, poor Yu Kong. Captain Sen's still willing to do my husband's bidding and hunt him down, is he? I swear, my husband is insufferable. Yu Kong's a harmless aspiring actor who asked me if I would act as his patron. Since my husband was away from the city, again, I accepted and gave Yu Kong a moderate stipend. I thought he was charming. That was how my husband presented the situation to the authorities. He didn't want to face the shame of supporting a humble actor. My husband's a fool, but when he lowers his head, all I can do is let him charge and hope he rams something solid enough to slow him. Probably less than my husband is putting forth as a bounty for poor Yukong. That young man doesn't deserve this. I would wager that you'll find him in the Scholar's Garden. Yu Kong was going to try out for that new play. I'm sure you heard about it when it was performed in the Golden Way. Made quite the impression, I'm told. Yu Kong was going to try out for a role as a scholar, so he may be using his costume to hide in the garden. He's not much of a scholar, so you should be able to spot him. If you happen to find creative Yukong, do go easy on him, would you? The poor boy did nothing wrong, and my husband is being unusually cruel to him. Good luck with your search. I have to get back to the estate. So much to do. Before you say a thing, I had a visit from one of Sweet Poison Lin's contacts. Fantastic news! I can up the bets. Now you can wager 10 or 25 silver on each roll. This is perfect. And I have you to thank. Thank you again for paying the fee from your own silver. Here's your repayment and a little extra for your time. A thousand thanks to you. I promise to use your generous gift wisely. Now that we can play for larger bets, what say we set up a game? That's what I was waiting to hear. So what'll it be? Will your roll be higher or lower than mine? High it is. Let's see how sure you are. How much will you bet? Let's see how they fall, shall we? Not enough spin on the wrist to best my roll, it seems. Don't worry. You'll make it back on the next round. What say we try again? Thanks again for all your help. Be seeing you around, I hope.
One cannot discover true enlightenment in the world. Is there anything else I can do for you today, my friend? Uh, of course. Good fortune to you. I hope you're not here to pester me. I'm a very busy, important, and educated man, you know. All manner of studies. The history of dramatic systems, applied theology, and, um, celestial integration. All of these are vital pursuits of knowledge. Not that you would understand such lofty matters. Celestial integration means just that. It's integrated, celestially. Thus, the relationship between the heavens and earth is one of integration and, um, celestial. It's a very advanced field of research. It would take several lifetimes to understand it properly, which is why my position as a scholar is so irrefutable. Well, you see, drama can be broken down into several systems, and I study the history of those systems over time, how they've changed, and that sort of thing. Well, there's the new system, of course, but everyone knows that. Then we have the uh, old system, which, as you may surmise, is no longer in use. That's a brief summary of my latest work, at any rate. Oh, it's all very complex, and I really don't feel like describing it to you at any length. That's how you know I'm a scholar, you see. An unwillingness to share all the information I have. Of course not! I'm... Ah, oh, Dread. This isn't working at all. How did you know? Well, you're here to hunt me down, then. Lord Rento has it in for me, and I figured it would come to this. I don't suppose running would do me any good. I was unjustly accused. I simply petitioned Lady Rento for some silver to support me as an actor. Patronage, it's called. She agreed, but her husband flew into a rage when he found out, and now I have a death sentence on my head. It's not fair, and if you were a decent person, you'd help me get out of this city instead of taking me in. It's the only way I'll get clear of Lord Rento's wrath. You need more proof than my pathetic attempt to pose as a scholar? How about the fact that Lord Rento was out of town when I built him? Not that anyone but Lady Rento will confirm that for you. Still, it should be apparent that I'm not some great confidence man. We should go see Captain Sen right away if you're sure.